Uh, what's going on YouTube? This is Fab of Brandon TV coming back to you guys. I've been hella busy lately working, going to school. So I know it's been a little minute since I've been making videos, but guys, I'm not going to stop. You guys know I'm not going to stop, but hell, a nigga been busy. So anyway, I'm back with this album review on Jeezy, Young Jeezy, guys, who I've been a fan of for a while, guys. His new album, this is my very first review. Uh, I was I meaning to get this review last Friday, but, you know, I've been busy. So, I am going to get this review on Trap or Die 3. Guys, this album is amazing. From, from 1 to 16, guys, every song slays, okay? I really like his energy. You know, this is just the, the, the classic Jeezy that we all know and love. Uh, Young Jeezy really, really put a lot of hard work and dedication into this project. I just think that this is just his best. I've been listening to it for a while. This is amazing. It's just been on nonstop repeat. I got so many favorite songs. Um... It has a lot of club bangers. It just has a lot, a lot of anthem songs, guys. It's just amazing. So we're gonna do this all one through sixteen in the air, which is kind of like an anthem, her hood anthem song that I was feeling. You know, he's dedicating it to his homies. The next song is G Wagon, which is <clears throat> probably one of my favorite songs. You know, he's just saying he hopped up out the G Wagon. He doing his thing. Uh, it's just you, you know, just one of those stunt. -type Type of songs I definitely definitely really feel it. I think that it's amazing it is what it is you know uh, uh, uh it is what it is basically number three is one of my favorites because I really like the beat it just really has a nostalgic sound to it uh I really really love it I just think that this is probably one of my favorite songs uh whatever is it faced in front of people it is what it is that's the message I like I like it uh, uh, where that is just one of those songs you know, when people talk so much shit and don't be about their life and they, they say they got it when well, nigga where it's at. So I really, really like it. I really think that that's another one of my favorite songs featuring Yo Gotti that is number four on the album. All that. Everything is laid out on the table. Young Jeezy ain't playing with these people, okay? Everything is laid out on the table. Okay, uh, 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 uh. It's all there, okay? All right, I, I love it. I just think this was probably another one of my favorite songs I was really feeling on this album. Uh, Going Crazy featuring French Montana. It was another nice song that I liked, even though I ain't a French Montana fan. But I really, really liked it. I just thought that it was a dope track, okay? Um, uh, about that. Now, about that, I was very, very impressed by Lil Wayne on this song, okay? I really thought that Lil Wayne brought fire to it. Even though he didn't have a long verse, I still liked it. Uh, it's just a, a cool song. I just think that they did an amazing job. It, I was definitely feeling it was definitely dope. Then we got So What, okay, which is just probably another song that I like. On that song, Jeezy was bringing that fire. Y'all know he be snapping. He be going in. He be going off. I, I got to give him his props with this one. It's just another one of my favorite songs. Let him know. Now, this is just <clears throat> probably one of my favorite songs on the album. This is one of those club banging songs where you just out and you just want to have a good time. You at a strip club. This song is amazing. This also kind of had a T.I. A T.I. and a Plies type of feel to it. Speaking of Plies, he is on the album. But this song had a very T.I. feel. I, I, I just, for some reason, when I heard it, I just thought that T.I. should have been on the song. But I really liked it. This is one of my favorites. The beat is booming. I mean, it kind of has a little weird thing at the beginning of it. And I really, really like it. It's, it's cool. It's dope. I love it. Recipe. I got the recipe for these motherfuckers out here, Okay. I'm cooking up something. I'm cooking up something, okay? I got the money. I got it all, okay? He's just getting it in. He's just saying everything. He's putting all this stuff on the table. I, I was definitely feeling it. Gold Mine, another song. Uh, you know, it's just one of those, those, those trap songs, you know? And I really, really liked it. It's really, really street. I really, really, I, I messed with it. I thought it was dope. You know it. It's just another song that this really, really, really was amazing on this album. Dope beat. You guys might like it. The next song, like that. Cool, 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 cool. These beats on this album, for one, just really, 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 really do it for me. I really, really like it. Okay, another song. Sexy. Okay, this is just another one of those 
uh, feature applies. Another one of those stripper songs, you know, where the girl shake, shake, uh, twerk something, shake something, twerk something. You know, it's just one of those tooted and booted songs that I was really, really, really feeling. It's another one of those strip songs. You can hear it playing probably in strip clubs and. It's dope. I, I, I like it. I like it. I thought it was a cool song. Pretty Diamonds. <clears throat> Chris Brown was going in on this song. Let me tell y'all, this is another song I think that might probably be a single. It should be a single. Come on, Chris Brown is on there. We know he killed. He he slayed. I really, really like his verse. Uh, uh, and Jeezy really, really, him, him, him and Jeezy really... They always do good songs together. As a matter of fact, it was a couple of songs they did a couple of albums ago. But I definitely, definitely really feel it. Never settle. I'm never settled for less. I never. It's just one of those songs, those those go hard or go home type of songs that I just really really feel it. That was the last song on the album. To sum up this album, I get this album a ten out of ten. Young Jeezy really really brought full force, full energy. Uh, he really had dope lyric. He dope rhyme. You know, he just had he had bars. I just love it. I love that. I love it. This is just probably one of my favorite Young Jeezy albums because it's been kind of a little minute since I liked something from Jeezy. So I messes with this album. This album is dope. Deuces.